All right, the next tip that I'm going to share with you is a very basic tip, uh, but it's important if you're new to Android. So I wanted to highlight a couple areas that you see on the screen. You'll notice that this area right here, these very large icons, uh, these things are actually called widgets. And you'll notice I have this large widget up here that is for music. You can add and remove widgets very easily in Android. And what I'm going to do is go onto this blank screen, and I'm going to show you how that works. All you do is you press and hold on your screen, just with one finger, and then you have all these widgets. You can do a lot of things. You can add programs to the screen, you can add widgets, you can even modify the wallpapers that you have on the screen. But we're going to stick with the widgets right now. So these widgets that you see here are basically widgets that come pre-installed with the uh, actual default LG G3. Or if you install a program, um, like I've installed Twitter, you'll notice that there's a Twitter one, um, Dropbox, Box, they all add uh, widgets. So if you haven't installed anything, you may not see everything I have. You'll have the basic ones, but as you install, there's widgets that get added. So what you can do is find a widget that you'd like to add, and I'm just going to swipe through and, and find a music widget. You know, it's Google Play. And I'm just going to press and hold and drag to the screen wherever I want it to go. Now it's faint, but it's, it's there on the screen. You'll notice that it's actually showing me in the grid where it's going to fall. So as soon as I let go, and if I tap back on that screen, now that widget's been added. So... Um, there are widgets for contacts, so you can have a full page that has all your favorites on there. So you don't even have to go into the phone. You just swipe to a page that has all your contacts, and you'd be able to launch it. Now, to remove your widget, all you do is you press and hold. You drag to the top, and it's removed. Now, that does not delete it, right? That is just removing the widget. Hope this tip helps you, especially those of you that are beginners.